Hey guys, uh, real excited to show you this project. I've been waiting all my adult life. I've worked in, in the artificial rock industry and I've always wanted a bathroom that was a rock cave. And uh, my wife's never been real too crazy about it. And uh, we're making a master bedroom suite here that's like 1,450 square foot. So I'm making her 150 square foot bathroom, me 150. So hers is gonna be granite and marble and the fancier stuff. Mine's gonna be, you know, a 15 by 10 cave and uh gonna have two shower heads that come off the rock in into a, an area here where my whole floor i haven't poured it yet but i've got a centralized drain right here and all my whole room just drains into one area so the rock gets wet it rolls down hits the floor goes in the drain uh, i envision a clean uh where i have a, a three-quarter inch stub out so i can put a little garden hose with a sprayer and literally just spray this room down in seconds and just easily right into the drain now so far the only thing i've really done is i've made this non-symmetrical window because this is a daylight basement and this room would be dark now i did just put a slider in for her room her bathroom which let a lot of natural light in but i don't have that over here and i don't want to add another slider in here so I'm making this window to where it looks like some rocks just literally fell together and made an opening and just happened to put some glass in it. So that's going to be something that I, I rock around. And then this is a wall mounted toilet, which I made because again, I want the space to be easy to clean. If you've ever cleaned a toilet that's on the floor, the sides of it and the bottom of it, it's hard to clean. And being as I broke my femur bone about three years ago, I don't bend too easy anymore. So that was one of my considerations. But I think the biggest one was one, let's get a black toilet because I don't want a bright white toilet sitting in my rock cave. It just doesn't gel right with me. The other thing is, is you can mount these at whatever height you want. My bathroom right now has got a 15 inch height toilet. And when I go to sit on it, because I can't bend, I have to fall down onto it and it's just not comfortable. This thing here, I made it 20 inches. So now I can literally, you know, just up and down and I have no problems and easy to clean. So there's a little detail about this toilet seat that I'm going to show you here in a few minutes that even easier to clean, which I was kind of happy to find. But anyway, right now I've got this almost ready to start rocking. So in the coming weeks, you're going to start to see me take this frame space and turn it into my dream come true of some high definition artificial rock that's beautiful. So stick with me. As I was saying earlier, the thing about you know this toilet, I really liked the whole thing about it. The tank is hidden, so that's kind of nice. Going to have one little access panel here, which I'm going to make a, a removable rock that hides that even. But the toilet seat, when you go to clean around where it meets the toilet, it's hard to clean. And this one here was just, I loved it. You push one little button, you clean that by itself, clean around where it hooks into, easy peasy, and then find your little, uh, your hole here and snap it back into place and then the other thing is it's a quiet close so i don't make no noise anyway stick with me we'll show you this turning into a rock cave here real quick come on close that's really slow huh anyway oh wow it's closing the last part if you guys like the video subscribe like share i appreciate you watching my videos i just went over 10,000 subscribers which was a kind of a mile mark for me look forward to serving you guys more with more rock have a great day bye